her away. And Madsen's made a goal. Oh, better start for Lambert. Lambert's out of control. Here we go. Up the inside. Second ride for these guys and we're underway. Newley's made a nice start off that inside gate. They charge into the first turn and the other three riders have disappeared off to the safe defence and Beauty is cleared off once again. Spike time. All he wants to do is ride his bike. Just look at that start he makes. The bike doesn't lift, just goes forwards. Everybody else goes across the track. The water's... The night is on and we're off and running. Jason Doyle comes out of gate number three, smashing start from the Australian. Wolfenden comes through in second place, and Frick has come around the outside of Robert Lambert. One, two, and four, uh, one being the most advantageous, but uh, three statistically not so good. But Jason Doyle really pulled clear on the way to the corner. Green light comes on, and away we go. Holder's made a great start from gate number two. That's a smashing start from the youngster Dudek, roaring around the outside. What a move from Dudek. Brilliant stuff from him. He was a little untidy, but he got the grip. Superb first turn for Patrick Dudek. Jack Holder initially makes a good getaway from gate two, pulls uh, clear of the pack, but uh, Dudek just realises he's got a lot more traction around the outside. Here we are then. Gate number 12, and we're up and running. Beauty gets a war, what a move from Smarswick that is, that run round that first corner rid that we've become accustomed to seeing. Yeah, we've got Dan Bewley on the inside. It looks like he's made a, a pretty good start. He's run clear there, but uh, Schmarslik has been watching the monitors, he's been watching every race. He knew where the speed was and where the grip was. Just got himself there, just ahead of Ty Wuffenden. Ty not able to uh, get there early enough to put the charge and move Schmarslik over too far, and that just gave him the perfect run.